Welcome to the project of MATLAB GUI control. We can place robots. It's also a material handling robot one. So it has a five motors. I think what is the wrist one? Open close purpose and open close fingers, wrist and elbow. This is shoulder one. So shoulder is forward, backward, left rotation. Elbow is up and down. Wrist also up and down. Finger one is open close. And the two motors back side of the robot to move the this whole body forward, backward, left, right. Four rotations. And uh, this is the battery. It was connected to the motors 4L293D IC, which is a which has an inbuilt dual H bridge job. So here was I named the motor connections with the uh, alphabets, and uh, here the main supply to the motherboard. So the main supply was interfaced with two batteries, nine volt batteries, two batteries connected in parallel. So when you on the switch, I mean when you on the switch. So the microcontroller will get the five volts after this regulator power supply. So here is the regulator 7805. So after this step, you will get the exactly 5 volts. And here is the inter uh, interface of Zigbee. So the Zigbee one, interface with this 4 pin. You can see. This is a Zigbee. So we are using the Zigbee here, Taran for module 2.4 gigahertz. So it's a whole module. So from the PC end, we are going to use the same thing Zigbee interface to the PC through RS232 using Max232 IC, the Zigbee module. So to get supply to the Zigbee model, we are using the same RPS section to get the 5 volts to the Zigbee to max to the IC. We need to connect this uh, to the CPU using a DB9 connector. It's a RS232 cable, so back to the CPU. And after connection is done on the motherboard of the this end transmitter section, which was interfaced to the PC and the receiver of the robot. Okay, so let's go to the operation. When I when I run this code. I'll get this menu. So the menu consists of the options until the different options forward, backward, left, uh, right arm, and uh, open fingers, close fingers. It has a headlamp also, like LED on, LED off, list of this down, elbow up, elbow down, shoulder left rotation, right rotation, shoulder forward movement, backward movement with video, and also stop option. So it means when I give the command of forward movement, it's continuously going on forward only. So when I give the command to stop the robots, it stops as well as I send the stop button. So let us go to the operation and the motherboard now. So we on the motherboard, if the battery was fully charged one, so here we have the one LED in the indication, it will on two times. See, now on the motherboard, one, two. That's it. It's indicating that the battery was fully charged. So let us go to the operation. I'll go on uh, backward mind now. You can see. When I say the backward, it's going on going backward. So when I say the stop, Stop there only. Then again, forward movement. Continuous is going forward. Stop. Okay, and the same thing. Uh, left and also stop. Fine, and uh, right turn. Same moment is stop. So here are the commands. Go on in the robotic come controlling. Open fingers. Stop. Same thing like close fingers. Stop one. And now uh, we stop LED on. Okay. And uh, then go on the we stop one. Stop moment. Means we need to send the start and stop both commands. We down. So like this, can you hold it? Hold it. Oh no. So the same time to get the video. Mm -hmm. From this camera, we need to connect the battery to this transmitter, AV transmitter, because we previously we tuned the video camera to our circuit, AV receiver. Connect this one and run the video option here only. So after clicking the video option, it will take some time to open the video from the TV tuner card setup. It's on now already. Right. So like this, you will get the video. Hold on a second. Yeah, you 
got the video. So now I'm going to control the robotic arm. See, now I will get the waste of one. So in the base rotation to the right rotation. And elbow up. Elbow down. Left rotation. Okay, and uh, this down, look at the initial position. To exit, you can go to the exit one. Thank you.